Now you're doing a lot of research um, on in the topic of AI. It, it must be an incredibly difficult space to research because by its nature it's just so um, you dynamic. Know, exactly. It's so fast. It is fascinating. I mean, I've lived in a fast world all my life. I have never seen anything like this. It's almost impossible to keep up. I, I put three to four hours a day every single day, and I, I, can, I simply cannot keep up. I think we've opened Pandora's box in every possible way. In, in, in every tech, uh, it's not unusual. Huh? It's just the pace is very different. In every tech I've ever participated in developing, you know, including the days of, of Google X, where we built incredible technologies, there is a moment of what we normally refer to as the breakthrough moment. So you found the tech, right? And then there is a lot of engineering that follows. You, you, you sort of know now how it works, okay? But then you have to engineer it and put it together and try it and then miniaturize it and you know, improve power efficiencies and do this and do that and so on. And, and you know, we're used to this in tech. We call it the, 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 the law of accelerating returns, that once you've got it, and it's now working, every 12 months almost, you know, compute will double or every, and, and so on. There are, there are almost ru clear rules like Moore's law and so on and so forth, uh, where you know that, that you're going to follow an exponential curve. The challenge with AI is that this exponential curve is seen to be 5.7 months. We double in power every 5.7 months, but it feels even quicker. Okay, and and you know it it is we haven't even included things like quantum computing becoming part of the back end, which is a few years away. Um, you know we haven't included any other new breakthrough. Uh, we're just pouring more resources on the existing break breakthrough, and it's just impossible to keep up. And and it's exciting in a way, uh, but also <laughs> exhausting in a way. Um, and I think the only way I will eventually be able to keep up is to use an AI to keep up with it and then tells me what I need to be aware of. <laughs>